happening folks, it's your boy Hat Free Speaks. We're gonna jump in today with Def Leppard. Def Leppard. You might already know that I've done a reaction to Def Leppard here on the channel already, and this one is called Rock of Ages, lyrics version. Lyrics version because your boy needs them. Sometimes I do get lyrics video, I do wanna delve into it, all right? So fantastic group, was not aware that the drummer you know, plays with one arm, which is great to see. I'm not, uh, that's the first time. You might be thinking, Hat Free Speaks, why do you keep talking about that? But that's the first time I've seen it. And I think a lot of you folks out there, it also might be your first time you've seen anything like that. Do you know what I'm saying? More more power to people who who, may, who might not think they, they're able to partake in any musical career because they may not have all their limbs. You know what I'm saying? Says who? If you've got a talent, use it. And that is proof, in a nutshell, if you ever needed it. All right, folks, so if you are new, be sure to bang that subscribe button, give the video a like, give it a share, because we're gonna jump in today with Def Leppard, Rock of Ages, lyrics video. It's the first time listen, first time reaction to the song and watching this, All right? So it's a blind reaction, folks. That's how I usually do it here. And that's how we get down and we get groovy. All right, so let's jump in without further ado. Wait, that's German, right? It sounded like German. If folks, let me know. Is that somebody speaking German there? Pyromania, burn it up, let's go. Is this like an, what are the guys called, arsonists? Is this like their anthem or something, guys? I like that. What, what, what that hum, the um, overdubbing, overlaying their vocals to create this this real ambient sound. I like that harmonizing. I suppose that's another word you can use for it. Check it out. So it's, it's giving a more of a full, fuller sound, whereas before it sounded like a bit like he's singing in a hall, but now it sounds yeah. <laughs>
again, I said, they're called arsonists, aren't they? We're going to burn this dumb place down, folks. This whole song is the anthem for them fire starters. I ain't talking about the song either. I'm not promoting anything either, guys. Kids out there, before you all get it twisted. Yeah, man. This is not what I expected. So Pyromania must be the name of the album. We've got the power, we've got the glory. Just say you need it. And if you need it, say yeah, say yeah. I'm not sure what you mean. Oh, just say you... Okay, so we got the power we, and we got the glory. And if you need that, folks, just say yeah. So if you want some of that power and you want some of that glory, just say yeah. That's what Def Leppard are saying. All right, I can see that now. But anyway, yeah. They're not shy about it. And now they're saying we're going to burn this damn place down. Reminded me of, remind me of that. I want it all, Queen. Because at the end, the guitar just kind of fades out at the end, and he goes, "Ooh ha!" Freddie Mercury does that. All right, folks, that was it. That was Def Leppard, Leopard, Leopard. However, you might want to say that with Rock of the Ages, folks. If there is, uh, if that is aimed at anyone uh, doing uh, bad things with uh, elements to do with fire, let me know because there's definitely. I mean, there, there was a bloody building or room on fire in that in that video so the album cover is of that and it says pyromania so you know pyro is it techniques they are related to and i did a reaction to um ramstein right and then they had all these pyrotechnic stuff going on you know fireworks here things being shot out that way explosions on the, on the stage and that which is quite incredible and uh def leopard here basically named the album pyromania and the song is basically that so i, I can imagine this being performed live and they're really taking the message of this song. Perhaps I'm taking a guess here. Stab in the dark, folks. That their performances had explosions, had the, the full shazam of like fireworks, lighting, effects, you name it. Because they want to keep the essence of the meaning of the song true. True to their, uh, I guess, performance as well. That relates to the name of the album. And this song about... It's better to burn out than fade away. That was one of the lyrics in there. It's better to burn out than fade away. It's almost a similar saying, I'd rather die young than old. There's a lyric, um, I'd rather die. It's a hip hop lyric, I'd rather die. Was it, was it like this? I'd rather die young and broke instead of old. I'd rather die young and smoke rather than old and broke. That's why I'm high and I constantly smoke. I don't know. Something along those lines. That was a two-part lyric. Um, and he goes, my memories of a youngster. Now I'm doing bad. And now these homies don't know me. Something like that. Anyway, so yeah, it's, it's, it's along those lines. You know, it's better to fade. It's better to burn out than to fade away. You know, again, that's, you know, talking about life. Better to burn out. I'm thinking he's talking about in the song about that. No, it's not talking about burning things, hopefully. Then fade away. Fade away into some mystical shape, form, you know, you're never to be seen again. You know, and it happened with Queen. They, they had tremendous success in the 1980s. At that point, they already kind of successfully made it. Bohemian Rhapsodies are Queen, Killer Queen, We Are The Champions, Under Pressure. You know, and I think in an interview, I did watch one bit of an interview where Freddie Mercury says, like, you know, we could easily basically step out of the scene you know, be fade away almost because you know we've achieved this level of success but we haven't we continue we keep pushing ourselves to to with that music because that's what they wanted to do so here it is Def Leppard it's better to burn out than fade away I don't know folks let me know if you agree with that or not for me I think it all depends on what you're doing uh, obviously it's a rock and roll lifestyle you know you only live once kind of vibe but Look, at the end, what's happened as a result? 
Andy Gibb, to name one, to name but a few. You know what I'm saying? Tupac, to name but a few. You know, we lost some great legends uh, to do to, to un unforeseen circumstances. Some perhaps out of their control. Aaliyah, the R&B singer, way back. You know, had that unfortunate plane crash. Yeah, these things happen, but you know, just thank each and every artist that I've given their gift and life and soul into the music. All right, folks, I'm blabbering on. Make sure you are staying safe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.